Hello and welcome to your preview of Training to Go modules presented by Technical Sales and Consulting. At the end of the preview, we will provide how to access more information about our training products. Thanks for visiting and we hope you enjoy the preview. Now that we establish what an electronic trip unit is, let's explain the settings that are available. Every breaker when installed has a trip curve based on time and current as seen here. Let's go over how that curve gets its shape. You may have heard of the designations L, S, I, and G when selecting a trip unit for a breaker. We will start with the L first. It stands for long time setting. It allows for long time setting for the thermal portion of the trip curve and is set as a percentage of the breaker rating, usually 40 to 100 percent, and allows for a time delay setting in seconds. The blue line here will demonstrate the adjustment available. The curve can be moved in and out along the current axis as well as up and down on the time axis. Next is S, which stands for short time. This setting is associated with the magnetic or short circuit setting and is set as a multiple of the breaker reading usually 1 to 10 times and can be bypassed for just an instantaneous setting. It is represented by the red line on the curve. It too can be moved in and out along the current axis and up and down along the time axis. The eye covers the instantaneous setting. It involves the magnetic portion of the curve represented by the yellow line. It allows for adjustment of one and a half to 12 or 13 times the reading. Lastly is G, which represents the ground fault setting, which covers the settings for the low level currents to ground and time delay settings shown by the green line on the curve. This flexibility allows the customer to coordinate the protection needed for all circuit breakers in the building system. Hi, we hope you enjoyed the sample video of our online e-learning module. This clip is from one of our many available modules. We are always working on new modules, but here is the current list of developed lessons. Low voltage motor control, molded case circuit breakers, insulated case circuit breakers, low voltage power breakers, medium voltage switchgear, medium voltage control, motor control centers, transformers, contactors, operators devices, protective relays, and lastly variable frequency drives. Outlines, pricing, previews, and requests for information are available at tsnc.com slash e-learning. Let our training to go programs train your people while you run your business.